Hi, hope you've had a blessed day today. Today I'd like to talk about Matthew chapter 5, verse 16. In the same way, let your light shine before men, that they may see your good deeds and praise your Father in heaven. When God redeemed us through the blood of Jesus, our future was assured forever. As we live in this world where Satan has become powerful for a time, we are blessed because it's God who works in us, both to will and to do his pleasure. In other words, the good works that we do in spirit are not our own good works. The good work that we do is the new life of Christ within us, it is the new born again life of Christ that we received when we were born that carries out any good works that we do so that others may see our good works and glorify God. We have this light inside to demonstrate that the good works that we do are from God and not from us. God doesn't tell us to go get some salt and share it. He says we are the salt. He doesn't tell us to go get a light and shine it. He says we are the light. Sharing God's heart is a part of who we are. As believers, we've been washed clean that we might live in line with our new identity. The world is filled with hopelessness. It's filled with the blind leading the blind and the needy looking for fulfillment from the needy. Our only hope is Jesus Christ. The true guide is the Holy Spirit. Christ is the true light that came into the world and we need to trust him as our savior. He is the light and life of God, filled with our human spirit with his own pure light. We've, we have been called to a lifestyle of expelling the darkness around us with God's heart to love, provide, and redeem all those who would just say yes to him. We are called to respond and stop putting a basket over the light he's placed within us. We need to grow through obedience to his word so that our life may grow in grace and in the knowledge of the Lord Jesus Christ so that we are filled with the fullness of God according to his power that works with inside us. No need to be apologetic for the hope that we have. No need to fear the opinion of man. We can love relentlessly, offer grace unexpectedly, and sacrifice ourselves so that others might see a glimpse of God's heart. Don't cover up who you are in Christ. Reveal God's heart in all you do, and watch as the world draws itself to the light that you shine from within of God's love revealed to your life. God bless you all.